Yo, this is your boy James over at Expect. Yo, operate out of that chair. That is my line. That is so not clutch. Yeah, that looks good. That looks good. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Yo, this is your boy James over at Expecto Go, bringing you guys the latest and greatest early business you like. Content. And today, 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 today. Yo, we are here to go over the slate of events for the month of October in Harry Potter Wizards Unite. And OMG. Yo, we got. New oddities, new oddities. Then we got an all oddity brilliant event. Let's go. Then we got Dada books being rewarded for each event this month. Each event. Then we got two back to back community days, literally back to back, and two full moons. Like, yo, Dark Arts Month, man. You already know. Let's go get hype, man. So, uh, what we're going to do, we're going to go over the details, uh, inform you guys what to expect. Information courtesy of the WB Niantic team, early access, so shout out to them. But yo, without further ado, let's go over this thing. All right, so infographics courtesy of, you already know, Orange Wizard coming in clutch uh, with the details. So the actual very first thing we will see in game for the month of October will be werewolves courtesy of the full moon. And that's happening October 1st. Now, in game is always two days before the actual full moon and two days after is the time span you'll see werewolves at night. So if you need them, yo, that's when you can start expecting them Tuesday through Saturday. But after that, during the full moon, during werewolves, we will have Wizarding Weekend happening October 2nd, this Friday, uh, 11 a.m. Pacific time per usual through October 5th. And uh, it's going to be featuring, it's Dark Arts Month, so it's going to be featuring Dark Arts. Uh, particularly, a lot of the foundables on the last page under the Dark Arts Registry. Uh, if you look at the information, the picture, we got Percival Graves, we got the uh, portrait of uh, Voldemort and Tom Riddle, which is so clutch because I need those foundables, uh, particularly the portrait to prestige that page and now have that page on gold and everything in the dark arts will be gold so i am so hyped for that uh but the details concerning that uh spend a weekend rounding up dark arts foundables including Destrals and tom riddle uh we'll have event details and a guide for you guys in a couple of hours as i uh this video is released so <laughs> yo busy day busy day uh, but after that, after that, we have our very, very first brilliant event for the month of October, part one, and that is Darkness Rising. And yo, if you look at the image, bro, the poacher is back. The poacher is back. And we have a new foundable as well, which is also an oddity. So again, oddities throughout this month for each brilliant event yo no spell energy wasted let's go uh but the details october 6th through the 13th will be the brilliant event darkness rising part 1 11 a.m pacific time start per usual and details state help return brilliant foundables from the nocturne alley including poachers let's go and snatchers which is again the new one you will see and so what's cool about this in particular is this kind of makes sense and goes hand in hand with the previous events i.e the baby beast and even the flora and fauna part two uh these are poachers these are snatchers they usually round up Fantastic Beast. And so I think we're going to get some insight into why they were being hunted and trapped by the Calamity. So, uh, yo, I'm super excited. I don't know if Grim is leading us to them and we're getting information about it. Like, yo, the storyline is going to be clutch. I cannot wait to get these answers. But again, that's happening October 6th through the 13th and all oddities. So much fun. And again, Every event, every event I'm going to talk about, we're getting data books, data books, data books. Uh, moving on down, this is where it gets crazy. Uh, first, new moon happening uh, October 16th. New moon is when you'll be able to see uh, Death Eaters. So if you need some great way to get some field guys, eight with Death Eaters. 
uh, two days before the uh, 16th and two days after the 16th is when you can expect to see them. But after that, yo, we got the very first community day. Again, back to back, back to back. Uh, this is the makeup one for the month of September. Uh, remember, everything was pushed back after the Dragon event. So uh, uh, make sure your paperwork is in order and step inside the ministry atrium where you can encounter ministry officials, flocks of interdepartmental uh, memos, and more. So it's not going to be a specific page like normal community days. Uh, we got a little bit of everything, and we can see in the image uh, we got Mad Eye along with the Daily Prophet uh, newspaper. But, but, but. We also have some more data books. So, uh, yo, I'm excited about that. Um, I need the memos and the prophecy orb to get that page actually to gold, and then I'll be done. So, I'm looking forward to like getting a lot of pages this month to gold because of these events. So, yo, I am super hyped about this. But as soon as we're done, as soon as we're done, we got to start up October Community Day back to back. Uh, happening October 18th, 12.01 uh, a.m. your local time again through 11.59 p.m. And this one is going to be featuring Get Ready for Pranks and Mischiefs Visit Weasley's Wizarding Weezes. And so that page is going to consist of, of course, we got the two brothers, the Weasley twins, uh, along with my worst fear. So this is definitely a trick here. Uh, the pukey pastels. And so that page is going to be front and center. And again, this is a great opportunity for your boy uh, and for yourself, if you haven't already, to get that page to gold. So again, it's going to be hype. And yo, we're going to have back-to-back -back community days. Rest up, get some energy, because it's going to be, yo, a busy, busy weekend. But again, get some some more data books. And uh, yo, I'm super excited about those community days because i'll be able to prestige those pages and then and then the last the very last event will be brilliant event part two darkness rising and i'm super excited about this and i think everybody is because if we look at the image the dark witch is back as an oddity not from just going into a fortress. We're going to see her out and about. I cannot wait to take AR photos. Like, I cannot wait to take AR photos with her. And we got the Dark Wizard joining her out and about as well. This is the first time. This is new. These two are new foundables oddities on the map, which we have never seen. We normally see in fortresses. So, yo, so clutch. Uh, but this is happening October 20th through the 27th, 11 a.m. Pacific time per usual. Details read, help, return, brilliant foundables from Borgen and Burks, including dark witches and wizards. And again, what's so cool is outside of seeing the witch again in Dark Wizard out and about is uh, the story again. So now, okay, we, we got the poacher and the snatcher. That's probably going to explain or um, shed more insight in regards to the baby beast and the flora and fauna thing and why they were being picked up and why they were being sold on the black market. Now, with this one, if you look at the image, we got some, like, rare artifacts. So, yo, it's going to shed some light, might shed some light into who's kind of running the calamity. And who are they working with? These cats might be working with the cat who's like controlling the calamity. So, yo, super excited. So excited about this. And finally, we have another, another full moon happening on 31st, no doubt, on Halloween. So in game, you can expect to see werewolves two days before the 31st and two days after. So, uh, yo, that is clutch. That is a great. That is a great way to end the month. Oh my gosh, where was like, come on, come on, full moon, come on. Uh, but yo, that's going to be it. That's going to be it in regards to the slate of events for the month of October. What do you guys think? How are you guys feeling about these slate of events? Which ones are you guys looking forward to? Comment below, let me know, and you already know. Let's talk some Harry Potter Wizards Unite. But yo, I am out. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys are hyped hyped for these events i cannot wait cannot wait um if you enjoyed the video if you enjoyed the little <laughs> skit we had in the beginning <laughs> drop that like all of that all of it helps helps the video and the channel uh reach others like yourselves who are into these type of videos um in the world of harry potter wizards united so yo if you had fun if you enjoyed the video Greatly appreciate it if you drop that. Uh, if you're just finding us or if you have not done so already, yo, 
subscribe to the channel here, here. We get all the latest and greatest. You missing like content, uh, gameplay, tips, news, updates, the whole nine. Uh, so if that's what you're into concerning the world of Harry Potter Wizards Unite, yo, consider subscribing. Also, check out our forms of social media, uh, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook. Uh, we post all the time, Night Bus Sessions. We actually also have a Discord. We hang out, talk shop, the whole nine. So yo, if you're on any of those platforms, check us out there as well but yo i will see you guys actually in a couple of hours <laughs> for the tips for uh the wizarding weekend event uh and again thank you guys thank you guys so much <laughs> until next time